Welcome to today's video and in today's video we will be unboxing and installing the Zekiteco walkthrough meter detector that has an infrared scanner for temperature detection and also counter statistics for people. This was recently installed by our technicians at the Ghanaian High Commission located in Abuja, Nigeria. So let, let's get straight to the unboxing. So right there we have the left and right panels and that's pretty much it for the Vita box. So let's get straight to the smaller box. Yeah, so on the smaller box there's a little certificate from Circuit Echo. Then we have the infrared remote control and the user manual. I just keep that aside. Then we have a supporting beam. Then we have the control panel or the control unit. It also is supporting beam. Yeah. So this is pretty much where all the magic happens. So there we have the support the control panel right there and we have some screws some cables to aid with the connection and that's pretty much all yeah so in the setup once you've chosen where you would like to um place your metal detector you want to mount the control panel first first supporting beam so you hold that and screw it with the screws that come in the packaging so make sure it's tight and firm so once that's done you would want to screw the second um, beam to the side panels you can either choose to do this first or you could wait till you've um, done the connection in the control panel before mounting this but either way whichever is easier for you would work just fine so we're just going to do that so once that's done um, you connect the cables to the panel so you connect the side panels to the control panel using um, this cable so you have to first of all open up the control panel first and these cables are given in the box so there's no need to worry about where you get them from so you just connect it right there and screw it tight then you connect the other panel to the control panel The next up you plug your power cable to the panel so at the end of the connection your connection should look something like this there are some two cables that are connected for the temperature detection there you will have our signed panel connectors the power cable then the last but not the least you plug another power cable down then you plug that to direct power yeah, so once that is powered on, you can configure it to any settings that you want on the screen to 5.7 inch LCD screen. So you can just configure the strength, the alarm, the password, the detector. And the funny thing about the good thing about this is that it has um, preset settings for any um, like situation, like you're using it in an embassy, in a prison yeah so as you can see if you're using it in the mall in the factory it has preset um settings for that situation now if you want to configure the language and all so once you are done you um just um lock up the control panel with the key and keep the key safe so no one tampers with your connection and you're good to go yeah, so as you can see, anyone that wants to come in, put your hand there, it scans the temperature. If it's um, above the required temperature, it gives an alarm. As you can see, that's the statistics for counts and alarm detected there. So just put it there, and that's all. If you have any questions, please leave them down in the comment section. Other than that, thanks for watching our video. Please subscribe to our channel. 
Uh, we have lots of concerts coming up. Bye for now. Thank you.